Hey there everybody, thanks for clicking on the video. Man, it's been a long time since I've had an outdoor video on this channel, a new outdoor video, and uh, finally decided to try and uh, produce a video. So I appreciate you clicking on the video. Yeah, so basically what I'm gonna do today I'm out on the tundra here, uh, just on the mining road uh, out by ATV. I'm gonna go try to catch some fish and uh, just uh, have a just a nice little day. It's a Saturday in the fall, beautiful day out, and I'm uh, just excited to be out uh, on the land. And I just uh, I have about um, I don't know maybe 25 or so kilometers on this road, and uh, I'm almost almost halfway there. Then I'll get off on a trail, and uh, then I'll go. Uh, off overland a bit and to uh, my favorite fishing spot so anyway hope you enjoy hope you stick around and uh, should be a should be a fun day Well, I just pulled up at the lake, and uh, really excited, really excited about getting the, get my rod in the water, get my lure in the water, and uh, beautiful day. A little bit of wind uh, coming from my right now from my back will be in my face when I'm fishing, but uh, really good, uh, really good. Should be pretty good, pretty good fishing. So anyway, we'll see see if I can bring some fish in. And I brought my little stove, and I'm gonna try to uh, do a little bit of cooking and uh, and all that. So maybe the shore lunch even though I'm fishing from shore but uh, yeah beautiful day can't uh, can't ask for anything more in the fall it's quite warm I don't even know what the temperature is but uh, warm for the fall so awesome So I moved to a different spot here now. Um, I was at that uh, other spot at the end of the lake, but um, I'm on the end of just a little point here. Uh, didn't have any, uh, no, no success at that other spot. And uh, uh, typically now this time of year, early fall, the fish are deeper water and casting into that spot, it's hard to get uh, out far enough to get deeper water. So I had another 
no spot in mind, uh, but there's a cabin right near that spot, a couple cabins, and there's somebody there, so I didn't feel comfortable uh, fishing right in front of their cabin. Like, I mean, literally 10 feet in front of their cabin is this really nice drop off. And so I drove farther down on the Esker. Um, you can see kind of what I'm on here right now is Esker. Um, I don't know if you can quite tell. Oh yeah, there you can over there. There's water on that side. I'm on a little point right now on this Esker. There's a little lake on this side. I'm not fishing in that lake. I'm fishing in um, this lake right here behind me. They're actually connected. Okay, you can see there, uh, this is the connect the uh, the water connection to the smaller lake on the right there. And a nice little drop off right about here. Been fishing for about 15 minutes. No bites yet or anything, but um, anyway, it's still a beautiful day and uh, just a nice little breeze in my face and uh, really enjoying being out here. Okay, we got one. I hooked one. Gotta get him to shore here. I don't want him to get loose, get off the line, but nice little lake trout. Perfect. Perfect size eater. Alright. Okay, so this is a this is just a nice little lake trout. Uh, perfect one man size lunch and um, yeah, I'm pretty happy. Pretty happy was able to able to catch this guy and uh, on a uh, classic. Oh, I don't know if it might be turned the wrong way, but uh, classic lure, classic spoon right here. Just a uh, five of diamonds, so pretty good. Pretty good one, so good good hook. Look at this. Look at this, my friends. <laughs> That's a beauty. Beauty. Um, just caught him. Just caught him and uh, gave a nice, gave a great fight. And first I thought I, honestly, I, I cast it out there and I thought I hit a rock. And, uh, you know, I let it, I let the count five and let the, the spoon sink and started reeling in. And it was like, Dunk! I thought, oh, rock. But no, it's this nice, this nice laker right here. Um, good, uh, good fish to take home. I wanted to make sure I had some fish to bring home to feed the family. My my family, we all love fish, and so anyway, um, ha I had two fish actually. Um, I don't know if it's the same one or not. Probably not, but I had two fish spit the hook out. It's very unusual, and uh, I thought maybe I need to sharpen my hooks, but forgot my Leatherman and. Uh, uh, use the the Leatherman to uh, with the file on there to sharpen the hooks, but forgot <laughs> forgot to bring that today. But uh, anyway, this guy this guy came in. He was hooked really good, and uh, he's just a he's a beauty beauty lake trout. Look at the teeth on that the teeth there, and uh, you know really happy. Got some food to take home for the family. Uh, right now, what I'm going to do? I'm going to uh, that little one that I caught. I'm going to fillet that set my little stove up and uh, then uh, fry fry up some fresh fish for myself fish a bit more it's a nice little point uh, really really good point here and uh, nice drop off just like I was hoping having fished here before so anyway awesome really thankful really thankful for this big guy of course as soon as you catch fish get some visitors get some visitors who want to enjoy some of the fish, the seagulls, but uh, oh man, they're, 
They're circling. I'll give you the guts, guys, but you gotta wait first. Hang on. All right, well, I've got a little, nice little setup right here. Shielded from the wind, which is coming that direction. And I'm just gonna go ahead and um, boil some water here while I fillet the fish. So, good, good to go. All right, so I got my little guy filleted and I'm just gonna uh, set it all up here and uh, you can see the fillets right there just some tiny little tiny little pieces um, got some oil gonna stick the oil on in my little pan I've got a little baggie of uh, what is it lemon pepper lemon pepper uh, lemon pepper seasoning so that's gonna be really good just gonna get the oil heated up and then I'm gonna put in this lemon pepper seasoning, mix it all in with those tiny little fillets. And uh, I couldn't believe how small they were. Let's see if I can get the camera to turn around there. There we go. He was a skinny little guy, but uh, actually a little girl. I saw some eggs in there. But uh, man, those are gonna taste so good. Just got some coffee right now uh, in after boiling the water. I don't know if you guys have tried these before, but uh, instant. Folgers Instant Coffee work really well and uh, quick cup of coffee they're awesome okay so getting my fish on there frying it there let's see, get, see if I can get another one in there Pretty small little stove, small little frying pan, but it uh, does work. does work good. Some of that lemon seasoning in there. And look at that orange meat. That's awesome. Okay. Well, nice little little camp here. Everything's going real good, and uh, except my phone's about to die, I'm running out of battery. But uh, anyway, fish. I think the fish is going to be real awesome. I'll just try a piece here for you. Um, Arctic lake trout. I leave the skin on just save time, so I don't have to do all the work to clean it off. But um, with that lemon, oh my. Oh, it's so good. With that lemon pepper, mmm, very good. Pretty much all done here. I'm just going to turn the stove off. Enjoying my instant coffee and going to fish a bit more. But uh, great day to be out. Whoa, boost the camera. All right, so I, right as I was doing my frying there uh, right over that hill right there somebody came over in a excuse me in a side-by-side -side and they actually crossed right I don't know if I can show you crossed right about there I didn't know I could cross there I'm, I'm not going to attempt it but uh, anyway um, didn't really uh, talk to them much they were just on their way on their way back to the, the town but uh, anyway yeah the, the fish fish is just turned out really good very happy with it and uh, just gonna do a little more fishing here a little bit more and uh, a little more eating probably have another cup of coffee and then I'm gonna head back head back to town so uh, appreciate you watching the video thanks for clicking on it hope it was enjoyable sorry I haven't had too many outdoor videos up lately but uh, thanks again for watching and uh, it was a lot, lot of fun, a lot of fun out here today on the tundra in the fall time. And uh, we'll, I guess, see you next time here on New Man Explore. Take care and God bless. Bye.